November was arguably my best month on YouTube. The staple of that month was people of size. Tammy, Amy, Nick. Those three characters have become a permanent fixture in the lore of the Oompaville channel. And if there was a primary character, it would be Nikocado Avocado. Over the past few months, I've interacted with him on Twitter, which is always very interesting. I've even spoken to him in DMs a few times. Very nice guy. Just kidding. He's very mean, and I think he wants to have with me. On a live stream over at twitch.tv forward slash oompa live the other day, someone said in chat that Nikocado Avocado had cancer. One of you said earlier in chat that he had that he said he had cancer. So obviously, being the caring individual that I am, we had to take a deep dive and get to the bottom of this situation. Nikocado might need our help. Is this what you're talking about? He just made a video called I Might Have Cancer with his his Amber Heard face. And then has he uploaded since then? I know he's been tweeting at me a lot. Oh, he still uploads, yeah. I can't stop gaining weight. Dairy Queen mukbang. He looks like a fucking ghost. Like some kind of spirit. I feel like he knows exactly what he's doing. He's definitely endangering himself by eating all this terrible food. My opinion on Nikocado has changed a lot over time, which is another one of the things people say like, oh, you're a hypocrite or whatever. You keep changing your mind on this stuff. This is actually something that I feel like is not, uh, <laughs> not cool at all, bro. I'm going to spank him on his <laughs> hiney when he comes over. I'm trying to manifest that for real. Let's watch what do you video. think of my haircut? Looks like shit. Damn, I messed up. We got to go bald. Uh, I did it all by myself. Yeah, I can tell. Now I messed up on the side back here. I'll show you. Don't, ouch, don't judge. Okay, Ashley, here we go. I want to smack his head and watch the ripples. I want to transfer ener energy from my hand into his head and watch it go. <laughs> and he goes, ah. <laughs> Today, ah, we are going to do a couple private videos for those of you that bought them last night. We got five new signups on my cameos. Is he talking about OnlyFans videos? <laughs> <laughs> Wait. He has Amazon affiliate links that he makes money off of for cancer diet books on a video that he clickbaited saying he might have cancer. Two steps ahead. I'm not against the idea of food definitely helping with cancer, but that's pretty fucking insane. <laughs> Click the link below the and diet. get yourself a cameo. We're out Whoa. like a special- Dude, if he doesn't look like this, look, look at his hair, what? I wish his hair always looked like this. This is when he doesn't have in it, I guess. He looks like an iPad baby. <laughs> he really does. And the only thing that really sticks out to me about Carl's Jr. is their breakfast. Have you guys noticed that I only go to breakfast now? I get their hash browns, I get their- He does sound out of breath, more so <sighs> than usual. And it's making me feel as though I'm not breathing correctly and I'm having to remember how to breathe voluntarily again. I look really pointy. When does he talk well, about getting cancer? That's what I want to know. Some napkin. I'm not watching all this. Oh my God. All right, look, oh, oh, okay. Okay, I could eat these two hamburgers, this chicken sandwich and this little McDouble thing or whatever. Six greasy ass, big, heavy ass, greasy McDouble with extra cheese. And then maybe some fries. That's it. These chicken tenders look busted as f This is a lot of food though. All right, feast so buddy. I actually have these also, over here, which I have. When, when do you talk about having cancer? When does he start getting emotional? I'm a nervous wreck. Oh. I was thinking about what it's like to pass while driving home. Isn't that sad? Yeah. To die? I don't know. These are the best thing from Carl's Jr. in my opinion. So we're gonna go for it first. We just skipped to a really strange point in the video. Okay, so he's eating fast food and I assume he's about to admit that he's mm -hmm. worried about his own life. Let's see. There's layers of iron to this. The juxtaposition. Mm -hmm. The dichotomy. Mm -hmm. The duality. If it seems like I'm kind of like sad, I am sad. So this is how he segues into it. It doesn't seem like you're sad. I'm it seems like you're unhealthy. Life, actually. Let's hear it. I don't want to lose my life. Okay. I feel very pensative at this moment. I like that. That's good. Yeah. Good word. I was thinking about what it's like to pass. He's having I'll a ponder. He's having sad? a ponderosa yeah. moment. I don't know. I'm it just... is sad. Do you guys ever think about how you're gonna die? Are you afraid of death? Be honest. I don't know if it's just a me thing, but watching these makes me feel like I'm covered in grease. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Look at all these people. I can't believe how many people say that they're not afraid of death. Please watch the beginning part of this video. No. Let's try. This is 
Now, I, wait. we have a lot of different cheeseburgers. I, I tried the watching the beginning. Did I skip over it? Where's he talk about dying here? Yes! Oh, can I say something for the record? Yes! My tennis balls, if you know what I'm saying. Okay. My two tennis balls. His ball sack. Um, The left one has been not strong, but very subtle. Doll ache. On and off at random times. I'd say like once every minute, once every two minutes. Ooh. And then I might go an hour or two with it and just not, and then it'll be like pulse, pulse, pulse. My left tennis ball. His left ball sack. Um, His left script is what he's saying, all right? He's got a damn stone ache. The more and more digging we started to do, the less and less it seemed like Nikocado Avocado actually had a serious disease and that maybe he just, his balls were hurting a little bit. The moment I felt for this for the first time was not, Oh, it was yesterday. So it hasn't happened that long. It was yesterday. Well, that's not that long at all. But it lasted. So it happened one day. He hasn't been to a doctor yet. And his title, he didn't even want to say it, by the way. He, he prefaced all this by saying, I don't want to say this on the internet, but I, my ball hurts. And he makes the <laughs> video, I might have cancer. Tara thinks he jacked it too hard. That does make sense. I had some ball pain earlier today, but it's because I sat literally on my ball sacks. My ball sack. I only have one. Now, let me tell you what I was doing right before I noticed. Um, you know when you have to, like, shuck the corn so you can eat it good? <laughs> it requires a lot of, like, peeling and, like, movement, and you kind of have to just, like, go at it to get all the yeah i guess out. so i was preparing corn for dinner okay okay, okay. he's shucking corn. and um it was a little too much too many times over and over that i'm used to honestly what is going I on i can right go now? over and or they used to call me the russian locomotive just steam engine Ru russian he's shucking corn now is that a euphemism is he speaking euphemistically? Because I don't, I don't really generally give myself a nickname with how well I can chef corn. The routine I did right before I right. noticed this at that time, in that moment. His routine. I've been in that routine for years. I love, you know, I'm consistent in this that way. This is insane. <laughs> this is insane. It's I cannot believe it. It's the only sense of relief I get from all this work. All this work. He just has to go to pound town. The old Russian locomotive. <laughs> You know? <laughs> Five times today. Let me just, maybe that's all it was. Six, no. six times. No wonder your ball hurts. Your ball is just screaming, please leave me alone. Stop. Ow. I have never once in my life shucked corn more than once in a day. His husk has to be calloused. There's a pad of skin on it that thick. Say there's a hundred pumps in each one of those. 600 pumps a day. Ow, fuck. If I did this 600 times a day, my arm would hurt. I would have to stop. No, uh, peeling the corn. I haven't peeled any corn today. Is he alluding? Does he have a foreskin? I think he does. It hasn't improved. You know how corn is like evenly smooth and then yeah. every once in a while you, you'll get a janky corn and it'll be like one kernel sticking out like a bump. So I felt for bumps, okay? I felt I didn't feel poop? any like abnormal lumps in my corn on the cob. Oh, I see what he's talking about, his ball. It's a very scary feeling, actually. Yeah, I'm sure it is. A lot of people will feel it though. Sometimes I say to myself, is it diet related? I don't know. Yeah, mo I, I can guarantee you 99% of all your ailments, Nick, are diet related though, for real. Wait till you get older, the twins will drop l down low. <laughs> Thank you, Skip. <laughs> uh, funny story, Skip. Very close member of my family who's about double my age. They have to hold their balls while they sit on the toilet because they touch the water. So that's in my future. Good, good news. I'm gonna give it another, another day or two, and I'm also not gonna shuck any corn or peel it, peel it back. And you know. okay, yeah, okay. So, so basically, he just says that his balls hurt a little bit, and then just makes a video, says he has cancer, and then just eats for 45 minutes, and then just bitches. Can, oh, he looks so sad. What is he? Oh, he's eating grapes. He's talking about the grape diet. Would help with problems. So I trust oh, him. He's crying. I'm not happy with me. Might as well show the truth, you know. What is happening right now, dude? <sighs> He was shucking too much corn, and now we're here. He was I shucking corn, and now we're here. out there that are like, hello, hi. You have no idea what they're battling off camera. Which you don't need to know. It's not your business, but. This may be some sort of self-awareness. I'm not exactly sure. Th this is a confusing arc. This is a confusing arc for me. 
You know about me. Well, I hope you don't have cancer, Nikocado Avocado. Hopefully you're doing well, my friend. Hmm. He's crying <sighs> right now. <laughs> oh, wow, he's doing the thing. He's doing the thing, the sad thing. I'm gonna eat more black grapes because that's what Orlin told me would help with problems, so I trust him. I don't think Orlin is quite, quite, has quite as sage advice as you're, you're giving him credit for, Nick. To be honest, me, would you tell me how to fix my problems? But my actually work, mine work. I literally go like this. I go pub med. Any problem you have, I go to pub med. Let's see, uh, anxiety amino acids. Okay, so this says that GABA can potentially help treat anxiety disorders, basically, is what this is saying, this specific thing here. So then I would say, well, look into, look into increasing GABA. How to increase GABA? Go on PubMed, look it up. Meditate. Go on a walk. Oh, He's gonna go so eat his grapes now foods, to prevent the cancer. <clears throat> My mommy's paid. <laughs> a 34-year-old man in A presents to the emergency room with shucked corn. Please heal me. Please heal me. After my cheeseburgers and chicken sandwich, please heal me. <laughs> Wait, are you telling me he knows, dude? What the fuck? What, what, dude? What the fuck? That is so fucking crazy. He actually knows. Look at me. It looks like he's dying right here. He's such a cute sleeper. Concerning underlying underlining discomfort in my left tennis ball to go away. You'll be okay, Nick. He's got too much piss in his balls, I think. If it's stored in the balls, then why is it leaking out of Nick Akata's ass? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? I mean, this is, this might be a new low though, for real, for real. This is like another level to the faking the, uh, the, the sickness thing where he was wearing a CPAP. This is another level. Let's see the one where he goes to the, uh, to the vet or whatever. I'm at the hospital. Hey everyone, this is my vlog about the journey I'm about to embark on. Right. If you click this video, you already know what's going down. I'm not sure what video I'm even putting this in. The beginning of a mukbang. Maybe it's for patrons. Mukbang. I don't know how in depth this is going to be. I don't even know what I'm allowed to record and what I, what I am allowed to record. I'm just kind of starting right here. Just pull it up to, ooh. You guys, this is scary. He does have kissable lips though, to be real. And also I got a very strong squeeze pain in my left tennis ball. Oh, oh, squeeze pain, bro? You got testicular torsion. And that makes sense too for the uh, vigorous corn shucking you do. He, he just has testicular torsion. That's fairly common. My dad had that. And I thought it had to do with what I was doing at the time. So I was like, oh, oh no, I need to kind of calm it down a little Blue bit. I've been doing a little too much lately, as you guys know. I'm on my own these days. Wait, wait, he was shucking his own corn? Six times? It feels like the left side. However, if I kind of examine the grape and I give it a little gentle squeeze. squeeze. that ball. Oh! And they're both boys. I haven't done one of these in a very long time. And they're like, try to get this, it at least to- I just don't understand how there's always so much background noise in his videos. Every single video, it's either- <laughs> When he's eating, every video, there's just some weird ambient sound always. What the f*** is this? <laughs> Hey, Nick Akato, come vlog in the bathroom. The only bathroom in the world that sounds like this. <gasps> he shows his pee. Oh! Oh, shit, it looks like Sprite. Shoo, I just got thirsty. All right, so what's the result? He's in the, he's in the hospital. Very, very crazy. That's good piss. I like that. That's a very Nick Akato moment. It, this right here is epic foreshadowing, by the way. Just him screaming, crying in a hospital bed. <laughs> oh my God, that's so dark. Listen, I'm sorry. Listen, Nick, I'm sorry. She's like, go ahead and cough for me. So she feels one of the golf balls. And I go, eh, eh. And she's like, okay, do the other side. Eh, eh. She's like, I can't feel anything. So what we have to do is an ultrasound. In the meantime, we'll give you an antibiotic to help with the pain. Because if, if it is a UTI, then that will solve the issue. So That's probably what it is. The ultrasound. He's probably got poopy in his weenie. <laughs> his poop dick. <laughs> He's got poop dick. He's got poop dick in his doopy. <laughs> oh my God. That's so funny. Bro <laughs> got poop dick. Dude, no, Nick, you don't have cancer. You've got poop dick. <laughs> oh my God, bro. I'm so sorry, Nick. That's just funny, man. <laughs> <laughs> we we should title this video Nick Akato Avocado has poop dick. So did Nick Akato Avocado need our help? No. I'm gonna do whatever I can to get him in my house, 
and eat some food with him and ask him the hard hitting questions. Press the like button on this video. If you want to see that happen, I'll do whatever I can to DM him and force him to do it.